Hey. Uh, food. And deciding, I want to try something out. I want to try doing what all their speedrunners do. Doing some sort of small speedrun here. My first time actually trying to use W Split. But I need to modify it. Because that title is really huge. I'm trying to make it obvious there. <laughs> I'm wondering if it'll work, but I'm kind of wonder if I'm able to do this. But oh well. So I guess I just need to start it whenever I enter this pipe or something. Need to get ready just in case this actually does work. Let's see if I can get it to work. Um. Aha! It's working. The timer started. Go. I need to get this, I need it just to keep that mess up. Ah, speed run! Ah, this can be taken because it's not warp zone! Ah. <laughs> I'm gonna get a good time on this. But my left arrow key doesn't feel like it goes down good. Oh, oh sp split! <laughs> so now that I've, I've made a split whenever he goes down the flight pole. This means that whenever he hits the bottom, I have to hit the split button. <laughs> Go! <laughs> I'm so used to waiting, but I'm like, no, you don't actually have to wait there. He goes automatically. Don't need the item! No. Uh, I must resist my usual urges. But this. No! No! I'm get in the way. Ah. Ah. Oh, no, 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 no. And here's where I put in the no warp zone roll. <laughs> Doesn't save any time doing that. Uh, oh, 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 whoa. oh, no, I messed up. <laughs> well, this is obviously gonna make it a pretty bad time now, but. Eh. Oh, now it's not as easy to risk things anymore. No, I can't go fast! I need this! I don't need a Koopa, though. <sighs> the time on this one's gonna be horrible! But then if I ever come back and decide, I'm gonna do this speed one against Zeus. What? That time isn't that good. <laughs> but if I ever come back to it, I'm going to do another um, split. I think I'm gonna like try doing another speed run, and then see if I can improve my time, which is guaranteed now, because if I don't screw up, then I can improve times. Oh, these two. I'll always get you. Uh, I kind of forgot, embarrassingly enough, some parts of these levels, so obviously I'm probably gonna die and mess up some more time! Oh. Especially because I'm doing it on the Game Boy Color one, which isn't going to help. Blind jump! <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Goomba. Koopa. <laughs> there! Blind jump! <laughs> well, I'm obviously going to be improving this time next. That's for sure. Whoa, what was that sudden boost right there? That was like a zip in a Mario game, which never happens. <laughs> Move the camera down. Where's the Koopa? Screws me up. Please make sure the Koopa doesn't screw me up again. Let's mm -hmm. split when I hit the bottom. Split! That was a horrible time, even worse than the last. I guess it's almost like whenever you tell someone you're going to do something, <laughs> it's like you try so hard to do it, and the harder you try, the more you screw up. I think that's what happens with speedruns. Remember my one Super Mario Bros. speedrun, which was just Mario with invincibility running through the whole one-to-one? That was not a speedrun. This is what I call more of a speedrun. If you're curious, I hope I don't get a game over, so I'm knowing I use save states to save myself whenever I go through a game. But here there's like no um, save states or anything, 
This makes me hope I don't get a game over and screw this up. Oh. Okay, I have one life! <laughs> okay, this isn't gonna be that fast, but. Ah! Shroom! Oh, fall! Uh. <laughs> oh. oh no, no. Yeah. Um, let's determine when the switch is Right there. <laughs> it's kind of strange to see me doing this because normally you only see the speed wires that are really good at the game. <laughs> Oh look, skip it! Never tried skipping it before, oh no. I'm getting that. No! Ah! That was gonna be a risk right there. I need an extra life! Oh! The more cautious, because I know I only have one life, unless zero counts as a life. You never know what games count zero as a life. Uh, wall wallpaper switching makes it slow down. I don't think this is worth anything jumping up here. Wait, there's a vine there, wasn't there? <laughs> Let's see. I think you'll just be. Oh, yeah, game over is actually restart you. I... Did they restart you? Oh, no, I had to quit, didn't I? Nope, didn't. Didn't hit split bell off the score. Okay, nice. Going. <laughs> oh! Uh, the Game Boy Color one really does have a lot of blind spots. Yeah, there, there's a vine there. I could have saved time. <laughs> this is how you save time in a bonus area. Huh. Nothing in there. Well, that's a really different sound. Look. Split! <laughs> Going to the same level, which I'm gonna switch to Ouija because it's cool. I figure I'm wasting enough time on the speed run. I might as well split <laughs> and switch to Ouija. Oh no, the blue part. No, 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 no. <laughs> Not messing up my run, blooper. <laughs> oh, Chief Chief's gonna mess up runs. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Uh. Jump the other way. Oh, somehow I just did that. Jump, turn around. Wow. Mario's like, oh, you're you're doing a speed run? Well then we're just gonna throw everything right at you so you're not gonna be complete at any good time. Didn't know if the game was gonna let me do that. Ah, go in. So I can split. <laughs> Flip! Seven minutes. Well then again, it's gotten hours on the timer, which means it could take that long. It'd be embarrassing if it took me one hour to get to the last level. Oh, no, not this one. This one's basically random. <laughs> Doesn't help I can't see him now. <laughs> bear. 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 Well, no, I need this. Watch. One's gonna come and hit me right now. It's gonna take it away from me. Bear. It's gonna hit me. Oh. Now that was good right there. Whoa, I remember this level being way harder when I was going, oh <laughs> When I just came down, I was like, no, I'm gonna hit you on the head, you're not gonna make it through this castle. Which game I really need, a, I really need a mushroom in these castles, or else I'm gonna die. Plus, so like, like I said, uh, embarrassingly, despite me playing this exact game when I was lower, I don't really remember the layouts too much. I just remember that, like, 
castle through four. Uh, oh no, I hope this isn't a maze. Is it a maze? Nah, no, 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 but it's just one that's gonna try to hit me with that. <laughs> uh, my closest behavior is where I must pick up every coin! And if that's not speedrunning, sh. Ha! Wait till it falls. Split! Now these times are better. Nine minutes. Look at how my time was really bad on 2 to 1 and stuff. Yeah, oh my, next time I'm totally gonna get a way better time, as long as I don't screw up. Uh, oh, no, no, third so one is power up. I still remember where the mushrooms are at the beginning of the walls for some reason. Oh. Ah! Uh. Don't tell us to look with a hammer bros or Ah! I don't know how that hit me! Bad collision detection in Mario, it isn't just Mega Man. Uh, I think that paints a star, though, probably help me. Oh! This is how bad I play when I don't have rewinds and save states. Oh no, the Hammer Bros are here! Oh! No! Ah, up there. Fine, then I won't get a power up. Fine. Whoa. 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 Ah! <laughs> Camera. Bro, oh my. Awesome. Now I can go up here and get a power up and save myself. Isn't there like a bomb in there? I probably shouldn't risk it. I mean, I just got hit by a Goomba. Ah! Oh! 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 Choo! Ha! Oh! Of course. Of course. They're trying to do the infinite one up there, I need to split! Split! I just figured, well, I might as well try speedrunning a game that I've played before, but... One thing I might have mentioned in some- oh no, why didn't I do the combo here? I could have gotten the one up. See, yeah, like I said, I forgot some parts of the level world, so I would have remembered to make sure to get the one up there. Oh. Oh, oh. An enemy outside the blind spot. Mm. Like, sometimes I worry, and then I find myself, uh... Accidentally hitting the wrong button. Or release it too early. <laughs> Am I already at the end? Oh wow. Split. Three to three. I keep thinking there's something special about three to three. But I just don't exactly remember what was so special about three to three. What is special about three to three? It's another one of these levels. That's what makes it special. Luigi almost falls off, but he doesn't. Oh my. Blind jumps! That's what every Super Mario World hacker would tell you never to stick in your act. Oh, I remember this part. When I cross these jump. I just love when I remember a part of this game's little design. Then I can get through it much faster. Especially when I'm sure I have a power up to back me up here. Oop, why did I even do that? I feel like I have to defeat all the enemies on the screen. Balls and behaviors ah! They're going to make me get very bad times. And yes, if you're curious, I did customize the W split color scheme. I changed it. I noticed that a lot of speedrunners don't change it for some reason. Well, it's a close one. But I changed it to, to a blue and orange theme. Except with some changes like the new record. Uh time is now colored pink. By the way, split! The last split is coming up. In 3 to 3, like I said, the only thing I remember about this castle is there are like three jumps with fireballs in between them, so I call it the square castle. See, I call it the square castle because of this. This is why I've always remembered it as the square castle when I was lower. That. <laughs> oh, I sure. I sure. Ah, of course. Then Bowser's probably gonna jump and make me die in the end. 
But still. Whoa, I thought that was gonna hit me. Oh, wow. More squares! I never noticed! Oh. Oh, whoa. At least he's got a good jump height. Oh, my. Oh. Split time soon! There's my foul time. 14 minutes, 13 seconds. And of course, you might wonder why I'm stopping here, but that's because, keep in mind, my speedrun is only to, it's to the World 3 Toad. To I need to end it before the Toad, not at the end of the castle. So, I'm gonna save it. Hmm. So now I wonder though, I think that I should end up like doing another uh, speed run right now because the reason why that I'm not going to world 8 is simple. Because when I was lower I only made it to like level 8 to 1. I never made it to 8 to 4, aka Bowser's Castle, so I never actually went through it. I've only seen people play it. I've never actually, you know, gone through it myself and completed the game. Surprising. But yeah, it's the main thing though. That's the reason why I'm only going to like World 4. I feel like I could totally improve this time. And then I could see what I see in the videos. Where there's like color coded text and all that stuff. So I'm gonna start it at the same time and let's try this again. Okay. No, wait, wait, wait. I just reset? I just reset. That's just in the things I need to try again. Let's go! This time I'm gonna improve my time! I'm guaranteed to improve it if I don't screw up as much as I just did. You me? That's where I couldn't jump for a second. Ah! Let's see how much I can improve. I'm not a good speedrunner, and it's especially a bad time in the game you're running, you don't even remember the level that. Oh my! I split early. <laughs> I actually split early there. I was so excited that I hit the split button early, now I feel like this isn't going to be accurate anymore because I hit to do a split early, but oh well, I was excited because I actually managed to get through that, but still, I'm 0.3 seconds behind, that needs to be fixed. <laughs> if I get through this level as fast as I just did that one, like uh, by not waiting for the star, wow, my previous run was embarrassing compared to this. I'm doing so awesome now! I didn't get hurt by that? It's like something's helping me through these levels. Something mysterious is helping me through these levels. Cause I'm doing so much better now. This is like an actual speed run. Look at that! Look how awesome I'm doing! I'm like 30 seconds, uh, 30 seconds ahead right now. Boom! 26 seconds ahead. New record. Oh, great, but that- it takes longer to count down that time as a consequence, though. Now that I know the lulls a bit better... Oh, no more of what we expect, oh, great. Not stuff like that happens, though. Oh, my ball. The mushroom! Oh! Ah, sometimes I try to button mash that. Hmm. Uh, jump. Oh, I'm saving time right now, and wait, wait, why am I later in the level now? I just realized that. Two lives. Uh, jump. Jump. That. Blind jump. Jump here. Oh, I'm gonna save time. Oh, boom! And that's how you save time in Mario. 53 seconds ahead of schedule. <laughs> All we gotta do is just button mash these buttons. I think Sony button mash. B and A. And I just realized, I thought that you um couldn't see um my input, but you can. Like everything in BizHawk, you're able to look up at the upper left corner of the screen and see my input. I was slowing down for these forks, I was all cautious, but no. Ah, it's impossible to avoid this too. 
But now I'm not on risk again. No! Oh! I didn't even touch him! Flat job. Mushroom! It's like Nintendo put that in such a tricky location here. It's that. Or to be honest. I'm getting it. Uh, I gotta wait for these to turn down. It's impossible to get through them. Oh! Still up too soon. See? I can jump here. Ha! Do I still worry that this speedrun is permanently messed up now? Why permanently messed up? Simple. The reason why is because I did that one split early, and you, you know I worry about things like this because I feel like it's not the most accurate, although I bet other speedrunners don't do things consistently. I don't consider myself a true speedrunner. I'm running through this thing, dude, setting my own record. But this is a total improvement. I bet that if I didn't have any uh, voice in this, it would totally look like an actual speedrun of the game. This doesn't change anything. Well, look at that high jump high. Oh, gotta fall. Currently, I'm one minute ahead, so as long as I don't screw up, or like right there, I almost just screwed up. Keep thinking that has to contain something. <laughs> I was telling myself waiting on the edge of a pipe, but, uh, can't resist adding a bit of challenge that kills me. Finish, finish, finish! My name's gonna be A all these times. Back to the beginning! Ah. Well. Fine. <laughs> Need to make it to the end before 6.28 or else the speedrun is always screwed up because all these mess ups I'm making, they're gonna result in me somehow making up for that messed up split timing earlier, but it's also gonna end up messing up uh, all that luckiness I had to say, oh no, just turn green, that's a warning I'm about to screw up. And now that it spawned me over here... Whoa, look at that. Blind jump. Blind jump. Oh my, that's how far ahead it takes you. Oh no. Life segment. Wait. Oh no, we're out of time. No! Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. And see this? Doesn't this look like... A professional speedrunner's uh, video because I have the little W split on the side, and also notice how my text is different colors like the green one that I just set. It's just like their videos now because theirs typically always has all different colors some of them negative, some of them positive. This is the most accurate to their videos now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Aha! That, 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 that's gonna be the hardest section of any speedrun. Taking a low bath this time, which isn't the best move. Well, I released her because, well, what? I got one of them to achieve change. Good. I want. Aha! My time is still blue, which is a sign I can still get a good split. 52 second that apparently two to one was not a new record at all <laughs> Because it's not color at all purple Here it comes. I think this part's kind of unfair because it's so random like that cheat chip right there You can totally hit me on the head like the one at the end of that level uh, One of them can hit me right now. Oh no, or it's gonna wait to the end of the level to hit me and ugh Wallpaper changes, they make my laptop lag. Oh no, no, this part, no, oh, oh. <laughs> they stopped appearing there, it's like, they just knew. They need to watch out the one doesn't hit me on the head because they still appear to move like if they were on a NES. <laughs> doesn't make much sense, but still, you get the point. Time to go into a castle. Oh no, not this one. Oh. And for some reason, I thought there'd be a fire bar in the middle. I guess I'm thinking about it. I think Six World Six's castle. 
And if you're on the bottom, then they will always, due to how they're loaded in the memory, they will always move out of your way. How did I just avoid that fireball? <laughs> I want to see if I can get the Bowser with this. Oh yeah, I made it to him with it. Bowser has such a predictable pattern! He always jumps right there. He jumps at that same timing every time, which makes it easy to speedrun if you start getting used to that. Button mash start. Boom. Oh my, oh my, why am I trying to risk stuff right now? I want to get a flower power! Ah! Does that make things easier? Until I inevitably lose this very soon. Oh, yeah, there it went. Yeah. Uh, I can never get that star up there that I think is up there. Let's pick it about later on. No! It's like they're gonna screw up my run right there. And that's really cheap. It it's like. Nintendo didn't change any of the levels in the game to make up for the smaller screen resolution, so you'll get enemies that drop out of blind spots when normally there wouldn't be a blind spot in the original NES game. Oh, split soon. Split! I split right when the points come up on the screen. This is probably why I shouldn't also be a professional speedrunner, as I would call them, because they're so much better than me at this. Thing and they probably played the game so many times. Oh no, oh no, I'm not missing out on getting a one up. One up! Interestingly, I think in, in the original game, didn't you like not get a one up from that combo? <laughs> it's like he hit me for not even knowing a Mario game. <laughs> yeah, they want to make sure I uh, get taken down because I don't know if a Mario game's enough. No. Why does this down on a one up? No, well, this is a mushroom. Mushroom! Land. Oh! I was button mashing jump there, but uh, because uh, the girl from Joker Wiki Memorial 4 just came up. Yeah, having your wallpaper change is gonna make you lag and it's gonna make you be unable to get to this level. Oh no, one minute. Clock, the clock, it's going down! Hmm. Why can't I just land on this block? That's what I keep trying to do. Why do I keep dying? Need a one up. I need a one up game. That one up is always an indication that uh, that's when you stop doing it there. Aha! Uh -huh. Combo. There! Now I'm not doing so bad. But isn't that coincidental? I do bad until I start running out of time. But, no, I never went there. <laughs> I'm now going to get really far behind. Oh wait, I'm at the midpoint. That was a very quick jump. Ah, oh, quickly split. <laughs> Look at all those times that I got so close to screwing up. I still don't know how, with how fast I went through the first level, I somehow got behind there. I don't know how. <laughs> no! Uh, you can cut that off and get an A. I'm kind of afraid that one of these times I'm gonna accidentally hit no there, and I'm gonna try to screw up the speed run. Oh. Mm. See, it looked like a pit until I looked down. The bad thing about having a small screen resolution. At the same time, all this time. Just gonna knock you off so you don't mess me up. Some of the things that I do tonight are kind of questionable, like, why would you let that enemy live if that enemy's just gonna get you later? Whoa! Awesome! I take risks like that. 
for here. I wonder if when I was lower when I first played this game, I screwed up on a lot of these jumps like I'm doing tonight. This game, I haven't played the game but one in forever. But, oh uh, well, we're just gonna end up seeing if I get any better through repeated playing of the game. And here's the last level of this speedrun. I doubt anyone else has done a speedrun like this. Oh, just go to World 4. Don't don't beat Bowser or anything. Just go to World 4 and that's all. Ugh. Ah, don't go back. Ugh. How come sometimes he goes to the right a lot easier than he does to the left? It's a Luigi. Oh! oh, square castle. Oh. Uh, again, it's gonna leave me without it. Uh, I'm that she can fire at me. I'm behind! Hmm. Yeah, since I'm unable to preview all the color schemes, I couldn't see how weird this looked, but look at how red that gets when I'm behind. It's like, no! Which, of course, would be my exact reaction. I'm somehow doing worse than the first one. Just because you start off a good start doesn't mean one wrong move is going to screw up your whole speed run! That, that always happens. <laughs> Bowser just puts a flame right over that left. No, I need to get to the end now. Now I'm getting hit in the middle of it won't screw me up. Bowser here can, but he always has a predictable jump. Okay, this time there's a 1 minute 23 behind. Hmm. I say that we try to beat these records once again. Let's try to beat that again. Oh, I just got point three seconds faster. <laughs> now, totally able to beat my record now. <laughs> Now we get shooting at I totally need to start power now. I'm doing too good at it. Huh. Ah. Okay, yeah. Uh, probably gonna screw up my run now. Ah. <laughs> uh. So get a 30 second advantage! Aha! 27 second advantage. <laughs> but still, even though no one ever comments, let me know what you think about my W split theme. I also made the flat versions colors as well, but flat, as we know from Windows 8, is ugly compared to the prettier. Like for example, like Windows Arrow. Seven. And that's the same thing here. Gloss and gradients look way better than for a flat, ugly beam. But I still made both. Ow! Wait, what? Oh. 
almost the end. You can advance. Boom! There's how you save time. One minute, four second advantage, new record. <laughs> button mash, start button until you see a flash and the screen flash is white. That's the sign it's doing something. Sometimes I think I'm gonna hit a fire bar, and I don't hit a fire bar at all. You just run here because they never actually hit you. <laughs> oh, but now that I got hit by that one, I don't get to do that one. Ha! Ha ha! That'd be embarrassing if I somehow screwed that up. <laughs> on the positive side, at least I'm getting my splits on correct timing this time, but... That first level run on the second time, which I somehow didn't get a new record on, it, it, it deserves to be like its own highlight. Just like me getting through the Mega Man Extreme floating area. Whoa! Blind spot! If I did the NES version, this wouldn't happen! I should get this while I'm here. Ah, spoil me, don't mess me up, cutie! Oh, oh! Uh, must go on the vine! Hey, I looked at it, it said stop auto corrupt, and I was like, I'm actually corrupting this game? Oh my, that's gonna save me time right there! And what I like is how the first bouncing Koopa doesn't appear. Makes it a lot easier. See and look, and if I don't screw up and have a power up, it saves time if I manage to not screw up. Yeah, when I was little, I always found that weird. It goes under my name, it doesn't go up, it goes down. Because for some reason, Nintendo made that sound effect happen on the higher uh, part of the harmony's uh, notes instead of the lower harmony's notes. Which I find questionable why Nintendo would do that, because it sort of destroys that fanfare. So if anyone listens to the fanfare in a later game and wonders, why is that higher note there? I never heard it before in Super Mario Bros. It was always there, but the game never played it because of sound channel limitations. Oh, Sun tells me, since he's like one pixel below that wall, he would somehow hit me. If I happen to actually hit the ceiling wherever he is. Mm. Look at that! I just did the wall jump glitch! Did you see that? He froze for a second. That little tiny freeze that Luigi did on that wall. Well, on that pipe, should I say. He just ended up doing a wall jump glitch. I mean, if I would have hit a jump at that exact moment or had rewind on, that would have been pretty easy to uh, check out. Oh. I feel like they're gonna hit Luigi on the head. Ugh! I had a feeling that if I jumped there, it was gonna get me. Oh! Oh! I'm talking about my blind spots. Uh, I'm known as No Name this time. <laughs> uh, oh! Oh, whoa, whoa. I thought I was about to die there by running into that one. <laughs> it's like you literally can't suffer anything in this level. Stop for a power up? No, Chi Chi's gonna hit you. <laughs> so jump? No, Chi Chi's gonna hit you on the middle of the jump. Which just doesn't mean you can't stop to get that. It's like Nintendo unintentionally made that harder than it already is. Whoa. You have to do that if you want to see anything and then you risk not being able to see where you're jumping. <laughs> Take that for getting rid of my power up at the end of a lull and pass. Not even get a father moving on until I get there. Oh my! 2 minutes 37 seconds lead? 
and then a 1 minute 27 seconds lead? Wow! It took me 2 minutes to get through this level? Wow, I'm gonna beat that. And again, I stopped there specifically, because I thought there was gonna be a fire bar there. I think I'm used to, uh, Castle 6, or I'm just used to that or something. <laughs> And here I go doing all good again. Look how good I'm doing now. Uh, oh. Run through Bowser. Aha! Run through. Jump! Hit the blooper in the hole! So, this is nothing to do with jumping and hitting bloopers in the air. <laughs> the fast loading times of the Game Boy Color. <laughs> you just gotta love them over the twice as long NES loading times. I'm kind of worried that that mushroom is going to go left instead of right because sometimes the mushrooms seemingly go in the opposite direction. It's like they don't want you to pick them up. It's kind of annoying because they move, but yet every other power you get doesn't move. And let's see if I can get that star I'm talking about. There's the star! I knew the star was there. Ew! Nah. That just made it a waste of time because I couldn't make use of the star. Now we have them. Ah. Now that's how you make use of avoiding a Koopa and somehow getting a power up at the same time. Oh! And see right there, that was also a waste of time. <laughs> because as you can see, I was trying to do the infinite one up glitch, even though you could argue it's just because I keep forgetting I'm in a speed run and shouldn't waste time trying to get infinite one ups. But you get the point, I was trying to get infinite one ups. Even though, ironically, that would be a waste of time. But what was also a waste of time was how that other Koopa came down and got rid of him right before I was going to get a 1-up. If he would have let me still get a few 1-ups, I wouldn't consider it much a waste of time. But he got me right before I was going to get what I really was heading for, getting a 1-up. Which means I never got the 1-up, meaning I was sitting there wasting time. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> For some reason, I thought that I was just on 3 to 3. I'm not on 3 to 3, I'm about to be on 3 to 3. Ew! How did I just step on that? Uh, it looked like a shot with a fireball game, I didn't step on it. Huh. And there I go, see that? My obsession with, uh, with killing every enemy on screen, even when it's not necessary at all. Oh my, look at that! That was beautiful compared to this other stuff I'm doing. Oh my. Best run of that level, period. 2 minutes, 54 seconds. I must ask, what could possibly go wrong in, four, in 3 to 4? Now I bet I'm gonna die many times because I said that. When people say that, they always fail. Like, when people say that, they always fail, like getting hit by a random fireball. Can I get a new record? This one goes backwards? Ha! Oh. How did I not hit that fireball? I need to keep this power up if I'm gonna make it Bowser, but look at him, he shoots it right at me like that. Bowser, you're about to take it down so I can get a new record. Aha! New record! Boom! New record, 11 minutes, 17 seconds. Now that's a 3 minute uh, advantage! And you know what's funny? <laughs> it actually ended up saying uh, that that was a, uh, that, notice how I said it was a 3 minute advantage? That was just by me calculating 14 minutes, then 11 minutes. I looked at my time that I was ahead, <laughs> and when I looked at the time that I was ahead, I realized I was 2 minutes 56 seconds. I'm specifically only a certain amount of time off. <laughs> I'm very close to three minutes off, but look at that. That right there, that's a good speed run. How do I save my current records? I might as well try to get W split back up. 
so I can verify that I'm gonna keep my records so I can come back and speed run again I'm just gonna get you out of the game so you can actually see my whole screen that's a convenient shortcut and there's Subomi who nearly messed me up but she doesn't mess me up like the other cute girl they're all cute anime girls but don't sickly and you know what's funny I felt like I had to enter that folder really fast right now my mind is still thinking that I'm in a speed run so you know I felt like I had to enter the W split folder and I felt like there was some invisible W split window counting down in the background isn't it weird how your mind works I ended up thinking that I was still in a speed run and still had time counting down and had to get to the games to get to the game speed run it's a bit weird how the mind works again um Hmm. Okay, there. I. Oh, wait. I realized what I just did wrong. I tried to open up my W Split Colors file, which is a made up extension I made because it doesn't give them an extension. Open Super Mario Bros. Deluxe. And just like before, there they are. There's my current best splits. Right there. There's my splits. So yeah, 11 minutes, 17 seconds. Can I beat that next? Who knows? Because <laughs> after all, who knows if you can beat your own speed runs? But still, just proves like a speed run. And by the way, um, <laughs> inside the video that will probably be uploaded before this, uh, there's that one game where um, Sakura talked a lot, and well, whenever she talked, the the text box went blank. I guess this is the uh, cutest dialogue box I've ever seen in a game. This is the cutest looking one I've ever seen, so... I'm probably gonna put this in my game. I mean, uh, this. See my development videos for details. But, even though it's from, uh, Car Country Sakura, uh, and even though my game is about Pretty Cure, it's a different natural girl thing altogether, but... Eh... Uh, might as well stick it in, because... As I said inside of that video, the Osher Collection one doesn't look as cute, and that's a DS game. <laughs> it just has like hearts, and it's like a square with hearts, no border or anything. Hearts are cute, as I've seen from Pretty Cure with their obsession with hearts. Like the heart right there, because they're cute, cute little anime girl, cute, cute, cute. But, <laughs> oh, and the heart right there, but, uh, you get the point though. <laughs> Basically, just that, um, despite, uh, Pretty Curve's game spamming hearts, this one, it doesn't have hearts, but it has stars and the wings from Sakura's weapon. <laughs> I don't know what its name was at all, <laughs> but yeah, the point, another Magical Girl series, to a clash, this probably won't make me worry as much as me messing up a split timing, by the way, split! Which was like a, I think I was looking at like some uh, some Half-Life 2 speed run, and the guy had like this um, exclamation mark split command, and then if someone uh, typed in a, uh, it would go split, and then he would be reminded to split. <laughs> yeah, you don't need to tell me to split, but I wish you had a little. I never forgot today to split, I only split early, although, now that I think about it, on one of the flagpoles on the last one, I did split a bit late. But yeah, splitting late is better than splitting early, I guess. I mean, I don't want to mess up my record. At least I don't just button mash the split button and then say I set the best record possible. I'm not going to be that cheap of a speedrunner.